this game is what is the name of this game? Buzzing game. Buzzingo. Buzzingo. It's a fun game for kids to play matching. Multiple kids can play. Yes. It's kind of a luck game, but it also teaches kids associating pictures with words. And then you can also go to the next level and start them to teach spellings and stuff, etc. So very very simple the uh, game actually. Yeah, yeah. So this game is one minute, Bitti. Um, this game is for kids three plus. But my daughter is two years old and she can still start to play the game and she plays it and has a lot of fun. Let me open it and start. Okay. One minute, Bitti. So these are the cards. I'm going to use two cards, right? One for me and one for my daughter. So there could be multiple kids playing. Uh, next, you want to remove this thing here. Out of this thing. So let me remove this. Okay. And this is how you place it. No, you only want one card, okay? You can choose. Choose the card, please. Can you please choose the card? Yes, okay. Papa has this card, okay? Now let's play. So are any but if the multiple kids, they will each pick up a card. Okay, Vrithi, come on. Now let's start. Let's start, come on. What will you do now? Do you remember what you need to do? Um. How do you, how do you get the words out? Yes. So there are two obviously, right? So I'm just going to paste it here like this so that you can see. But this one is for her and this one is for me. Okay, Vrithi, what is the word that you have? Can you please tell me? What is this? Cut. No, what is this? Cut. No. This is Papa's and this is Virti's. Okay. You can tell me what is the, do you have, what is this? Cap. This is? Cap. Cap. Yes. Cap is also called as hat. And what is this? Pineapple. Do you have a matching? No, not matching. Does Papa have matching? No, not matching. Okay. So now what you need to do is you need to reverse it, right? Because you want in the next turn, Neither. when the card does I come in, you want, Neither. one minute, but you sit down. I don't see so that in the next turn, the other person gets it. So now I, I should get the I should get the hat in the next turn, and she should get the pineapple. So I'm going to just switch it. Sit down, Mirti. Come on, get, an, get another word. Come on, get another word, please. Yeah. Put it back. Okay. This is what. Oh, this is for the uh, matching, matching. Okay, yeah. Oh, matching, matching, how to? Okay. It's a matching. No, Vitti has this. Papa has this. Come on. But that's this, you know. What is this, Vitti? You have to say what it is. Um, car. No, what is this? Buzz, buzz. You. Yeah, but what is buzz? What is this? B. 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 And this is a B. car. B. 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 Switch. Right. So we both got the word and. B. And every time, this is a car, and every time your kid puts the word, you have to start with a... Wait, I'm not like... So, every time your work kid says... Sit down properly, Mirti. <laughs> sit down, okay. She's very excited. So, every time you place the word, you need to ask them to speak the word lo out loud. Speak, the, speak the word out loud, right? That way they learn the word. And then later on, you can go to spelling. She's too small, she's not three years old yet. So she does not know spelling, so I am not going to go to that level. But you can easily go where they can only place the word if they know the spelling. Which basically may encourage them to learn. Come on, Mirti, next word. Come on. Okay, next word. Look, look, look back. Okay, now do friend. Get a word. Okay. So, we will do this. This one is for... Ice cream. Matching. And banana. Matching. Okay, come on, next one. Come on. What is how she said ice cream? So, you need to say the word. Okay, now is this a matching word? No. No, Papa also has no matching. So, notice what I am doing, right? The word came like this, so I am going to reverse them. So that I get ladybug later reverse on. Reverse the word. Okay, Virti, come on. Do it properly, do it. Okay, Virti, come on. No tree and eyes, no eyes. No Switch. Eyes. So now I should hopefully get in the next time whenever it happens, I should get the tree. Come no on. Eyes. Fast, I want a fast girl. Careful. No. Ball and clothes. Oh, Papa found clothes. Go 
Okay, come on. We'll do the next one. Come on, next, next, next. I get two. Come on, yeah, Vinti got two. Okay. Two. Hand and dinosaur. Vinti got two. Vinti, what is this? Yeah, two, you're right. But what is this? Hand. Hand. I got three. And Papa got three. Very good. Come on. See how she's also learning to count. Big banana. No, that is for Papa and this one is for you. Oh, no. Not matchy. Pineapple nut. Yeah, notice she said pineapple. It means it's not matchy. Come on, come on, come. Do it next. Clothes and flower. What is this? Papa is the... What is Only one left. One left, okay. How many Papa wants? One. Okay. Luckily, coincidentally, we both got one remaining. Now let's start. Let's do the last round. We think got some butterfly and Papa. Butterfly, butterfly. Next. What do you say? Bazingo. Bazingo, yeah. So she said Bazingo. I did not get a match. So obviously, it did not work for me. Bazingo. So, yeah, so Virti. Wins. Wait, how many does Virti have? Virti has to first learn to count. Five. You have to count. Count all of the words. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. How many Virti has? Nine. And how many Papa has? Um, nine. Papa, count count count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, you don't count properly. Come on. How many Papa has matching? Come on. Papa ke katla malaya na ada ada na Papa ke katla malaya chow. Have to count all the orange ones. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, you did not count properly. One, one, two. Yeah. Count properly. Come on. One, one, two, one, two. Two, three, four, five. Two, three. Three. Four. Four, bolo. Two. Five. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. How many Papa has? Eight. And Vritti has nine. Nine. So who has more? Vritti. Yes, you are right. Good job. And that's how you you play the game. Fun game to play, and you can later on ask your kids to do arranging stuff. You can see my daughter is arranging stuff now. It just makes it easier. So yeah, very happy with it. Uh, my daughter learned. She's not even three years old, but she learned all the words very very quickly. So it's fairly easy game. So next level, you can keep this for some time, and then later when she starts to learn to spell, then every time you place the word, you also have to spell it. That's that's when you increase the difficulty. So fun to play. Very happy with it. Can you please say bye bye? Bye bye. Thank you. No, look here and say. Bye.